Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about systems of equations, word problems. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here. Yellowstone National Park is a popular field trip destination. This year, the senior class at High School A and the senior class at High School B both planned trips there. The senior class at High School A rented and filled seven vans and 10 buses with 332 students. High School B rented and filled four vans and 15 buses with 459 students. Each van and each bus carried the same number of students. Find the number of students in each van and in each bus. Okay. Whew. We gotta find some equations out of this word problem to extract that information. The first part, High School A. They said they filled seven vans, so 7 times V, V being the number of students in each van, plus 10 buses, B being the number of students in each bus, with 332 students. High school B rented and filled 4 vans and 15 buses for a total of 459 students. And again, V and B represent the number of students that can fit in each van and each bus. All right. Well, now we have our system of equations we can solve. I'm going to do this one by substitution. I'm going to get this V by itself first. So I subtract a 15B to both sides. And we have 4V equals 159, or oh, sorry, 459, oof, minus 15B. Divide both sides by 4 here. And V equals 459 divided by 4 which is 114.75 minus 15 divided by 4, which is 3.75. Don't be afraid of the decimals. Same process as always, just as with decimals. We now have V completely by itself here. And so we're going to use that and we're going to substitute that in for this V. So 7 times, bring over that 114. 0.75 minus 3.75 B plus 10 B equals 332. And now we have an equation with one variable and let's go solve for it. First we need to distribute. Again, same process as always. 7 times 114.75 is 803.25. 7 times uh, negative 3.75 we have a minus 26.25, and that's B, plus 10B equals 332. Now we can combine our like terms. Subtract an 803.25 to both sides. And that cancels out here. And we're left with on the right, well, 332 minus 803, okay, comes out to be a negative 471.25, and it's minus 803.25, <laughs> okay? Then, we need to combine negative 26.25 and 10b, and that comes out to be a negative 16.25b. Divide both sides by negative 16.25, And B equals, well, the negatives cancel out to be a positive, and this actually comes out to be 29. So 29 students are on each bus. So let's find the students, number of students for each van. We take that 29 and we're plugging it in for this B. So V equals 114.75 minus 3.75 times 29. Well, V equals 114.75 minus 3.75 times 29 is 108.75. V now equals 114.75 minus 108.75 is 6, and 6 students. So, our uh, final answer here, the vans can hold 6 students and the buses can hold 29 students. Hope this video was helpful, and if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, 
Thanks for watching. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. MinuteMathTutor.com